a lot of things can affect the price of food products rising. Labor costs, transportation costs, politics, but one of the biggest factors is weather. The agriculture industry is very sensitive to changes in climate and extreme weather. Over the last decade, climate change has had a huge impact on the quality of farmland for this reason. From anything between irregular patterns of floods and droughts, farmers have gotten hit with bad weather. And a lot of farmers don't have the equipment to counteract that change. Because of this, healthy crops have gotten more and more expensive for farmers to maintain. In 2007, the price of corn, soybeans, and other grains drove upward dramatically and only went back down in 2014. But the USDA expects we'll see retail food costs rise by up to 1% over the next year. And when there's a rise in retail food cost, it typically means farm and wholesale prices are rising as well. Just last month in April, wholesale food costs jumped by 0.9%, the highest it spiked in three months. Many farmers and economists have stated that the way to combat these rising prices is for world leaders to focus on supporting scientists to work on more solutions for climate change. But for business owners, there aren't too many options beyond managing product purchases with a focus on reducing food waste. At Nix86, we've designed our software to do just that. We give you the tools to easily track the prices of the products you need and forecast your future purchases. Be sure to check out our phone app and our website in the description below and contact us at info at nix86.com for more information. We want to hear from you. Let us know what you'd like to see in our next video in the comments below. Thanks for watching. See you next time.